I need you to take this. Okay, are you ready? Okay. To the devil I look, to call upon a crook, with my blood written in this book, the bones of a skelly and the dyes of a flower come forth with this power you coward I call upon you crook oh I call upon you Tom Nook Oh my god, it's Tom Nook! Oh my god! Oh god, oh god, oh god. Well, that was good. I don't even know what happened. You don't have to know, but you'll find out soon. Are you, why were you trying to call Tom Nook? I wanted to see if you can get me a discount code for Animal Crossing. <laughs> <laughs> this is my crib. It's empty. But I will get to it. Then what I have. Well, I... No. I haven't even built a house yet. But you built a statue! I still live in a tent. So, like, that's pretty epic. <laughs> but it's not a house. <laughs> I have a safe place. That's my sheep. He doesn't talk much. He had some brain damage, so he doesn't really know how to move or anything. He's been here for a few days. Oh, nice horse. Thank you. Fast and test. Ho! Oh, crazy! <laughs> yeah, it's pretty fast. I oh. still need a horse, oh. too. I'm pretty behind on this game because I've been building. Hello, it's me, Water Bluga, and we are here today on the Voidcraft server at my house. Yes, that is right, I have a house now, so now I have a place to sleep instead of sleeping in the middle of, you know, death and destruction, and I also have places to store my stuff. However, it's not fully finished yet because this upstairs region hasn't been touched yet. However, I will get to it when I feel like it. So now that I have a place to sleep and keep my stuff in, I want to start working on the bigger projects that I've had in mind. And right now, I live in the Kainalu region, which is the tropical side of the world where we focus on the ocean and other aquatic things. And I wanted to live on this side of the world in the Kainalu region because I wanted to be close to where I came from, you know, the ocean. I wanted to be close to my beluga family. However, they didn't like that I could walk on land, and they didn't like that I could talk, and that upset me. So I'm stuck here, and my base, I have decided, is gonna be focused on fresh water. That's right, not on salt water, because my salt water family betrayed me. I'm gonna be focusing on fresh water, like rivers, streams, ponds, lakes and such. So as you can see, I have started to clear out this forest. I have a lot more to go, but I've done a good amount so far. Because what I want to do is I want to have a giant tree in the center of a surrounding village, I guess? Not a big village, just a miniature one so that I have my own town that I can rule and conquer. And then from the tree, along with the roots, I want rivers to branch out. And yeah, 
that's kind of all that I have in mind right now. I might even put some like giant freshwater fish swimming around in the sky, but you know, nothing is set in stone right now. And that's okay, because I'll figure it out as I go. So what I have to do now is I have to continue clearing out this forest. So either right here or right there, I want to have the giant tree, and then from the tree I want a river going that way, that way, that way, and that way. And then in between each river there will be like a couple houses here and there with a lot of terraforming going on. So I have to, I have to get to work because I have a lot to do. So by the next episode this forest should be cleared, I hope. So, you know, that's kind of all I have right now. So, uh, bye! Hey.